that the joy of the Lord is truly in you. If in truth it is, let me hear you shout a living hallelujah. I want you to have your seat as quick as possible, but hold on. That seat you will have now shall translate your destiny I'm standing here now Sanctifying that seat. Monja ijoko no simimo. Prophesying upon that seat. Monso asotele sorry ijoko no. As you will sit on it. Beauty ma ijoko leori ijoko no. The grace that translates destiny. Ori ofeto manji anyomu ati kada rapa daniri. From every place of low. Lati anwo ebi petele. To the summit of greatness, shall sit with you. It does not really matter what your current situation and location or position is what I am saying to your seat is said in his word that the Lord said to my Lord sit at my right hand there are places to sit and he told him in clear terms until I make all your enemies your footstool whoever is here and is able to find the voice of a man every seat that will not favor you the Lord will relocate you from there. Hey, hey, hey! Olu wa yo gbe okro ni ori awon ejoko ti ko se anfani won yi. It does not concern me. Ko kon mi ko se pelu mi. Whoever is behind your story of negativity what I know is that Jesus lives and his word lives so therefore every location and position that you will occupy from now shall bring forth the greatness of God in your life. Amen. I am speaking the mind of God. He says in his word, I know my thoughts towards you. It is not the thought of evil. It is of peace. And to give you an expected end. So I declare from today's service the manifestation of a great life shall be made manifest in your life. Amen. So shall it be. Now you can see. We 
We give all glory to God. For the grace of life. For alafia ati walai. The power of his presence. Agbara ifara honre. And what I love to refer to. At the onti no me man dosilati so lati tokasi. The providential power of his pentagonal blessings. Ikbese ibukonre lokpo yanturu. Agbara ikbese. Agbara ikbese. Oh my God. Jesus. The power to be fruitful. Agbara lati pisi. The power to multiply. Agbara lati posi. The power to replenish. Agbara lati nia tunche. The power to subdue. Agbara lati pori. And the power to dominate. Ati agbara lati bai shakoso. If he has not done this for us, we would not have been here today. So glory be to his name. That said, you are highly welcome to church. To the very presence of God. Where there is fullness of joy. And happiness on his right side. Upon this I pray for you. No one visits God. And return from his presence empty. You will not end today's service with emptiness. Amen. You might have come in with emptiness, with lack or little, but you will return home with bountiful. Amen. In the name of Jesus. I appreciate the priest of the Most High upon this mountain and the body of clergy serving under him I pray that the oil of the Almighty upon them will not run dry Amen I appreciate the management of this church both male and female and every structure of this church for giving me this grace to mount this podium and share the truth of the kingdom of God. I especially appreciate the management that put these three days together for their hospitality towards me and I pray for them that anywhere you go the Lord will be there to receive you Amen in the, name, in the name of Jesus. Quickly, let's go to today's business. I started a journey here two days ago. Which we tag the sound of abundance. And I made it clear upon this mountain. This is more of a meeting. A meeting between God and your needs. God has summoned a meeting. The meeting is ending today. And the communique of the meeting will be delivered. It is about God and 
what your destiny needs to represent God and represent him well to so be the pleasure of God he created you to be that is exactly why we are here on the first day I spoke briefly about the movement of God as it has to do with sound anyone that will encounter God and experience the goodness the abundance of God must also have the ear to understand the sound of God the movement of God is announced through sounds the sounds may be ugly and it may be beautiful but the truth of the matter is sounds herald the coming of God where there is no sound there is no divine presence and there is no supernatural manifestation that you, must, you will get anything from God. First understand the movement of his son. This was what I leveraged on on the second day. And I related it to the mechanics of unnessing abundance. The mechanics of harnessing abundance that comes from the presence of God. I made it clear succinctly that for you to enjoy the abundance of God, you must seek the kingdom of God no one finds God that he will not seek until you find God you can't find his provisions don't be marveled about the successes of people around you there are several shortcuts that people walk through to be blessed and you may look at yourself why am I like this all these shortcuts leads nowhere Except perdition. Am I speaking to someone? I also told them yesterday to enjoy the abundance of God. Try to know the sound of the movement. I also said to them, number three, desire and improve your perception. Your ability to discern spiritual things. A whole lot of people have walked past the abundance without knowing. They have eyes they could not see, they have ears they could not hear. One year, 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 
Before I continue on this same theme, let me digress a little into today's lesson. The first and the second lesson read to us. Because it is the tradition of the church to do that. Am I speaking to someone here? Do not look at me and see me as your regular preacher. See me in a different light. And permit all my excesses. Are we still together? Now, talking about the lessons. I still found abundant life in it. It still lead us to the theme of the three days. So it is not even about digression. We are still on course. Both the first and the second lesson is talking about abundant life through Christ Jesus. He's making it known to us that one of the business of Jesus Christ upon the face of the earth is to redeem us and give us abundant life. John chapter 10 verse 10 says so the thing comes best to steal, to kill and to destroy but I have come to that you might have life and have it in abundance this is why he came what Elijah said to Ahab is not new. It is within the confine of the plan of God to give, to give everything in abundance including life including wealth including children and everything that we may so desire that is in the purpose of God for our lives. Am I still speaking to someone here? Are they really following us? The Lord is very willing. He is ready. And available to do that. Which, which he created us for. He created us for his pleasure. Revelation chapter 4 verse 11 tells us. So he is willing to do. That which will bring out his pleasure in our lives. God sees us as a window to showcase himself. We are the departmental shelf of the Lord upon which he displays his goods. Anytime God beholds you, what he sees is his pleasure. Your presence and your movement in his sight. 
Delight God every time. This is why David said, I am fearfully and wonderfully made. You are not a common human being. You are not ordinary. God took time to think of your creation. You were carefully and thoughtfully made. To the test, Kimurin, to the test and the light of God. See, it is that is what the pleasure of God is the scripture says everyone that I have made I have made them for my glory he said to Israel you are my servant in whom I will be glorified. Jesus was moving on the streets with his disciples and they saw a blind man and the disciples said he was a sinner and his parents were sinners. Jesus said no. Can't you see beyond the ordinary? This guy is not a sinner. His parents had no sin. But God created him blind and positioned him here along my pathway that the glory of God might be made manifest. Hold on. Thank you, sir. What are you going through in life? What are you going through? That you think the hand of the devil is behind it. Jesus just told you now. Even though the man was blind. It was still the delight of God. Am I speaking to somebody? Your situation is known to God. Embedded in that situation. That you want to, because of it, go to Babalawo or Mamalawo. What is Yemiwo? Babalawo at Mamalawo. Okay. okay. God is in the know and embedded in that situation is the pleasure of God is the delight of God only if you can see beyond the ordinary why has God not moved you from that situation? Sin. 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 God is so delightful to pull you out of any situation. He wants to lead you and lift you. Oh my God. Yes. Oh long be me fool. Oh long be me sorry. Oh Lord. I know say more on a singer. God bless you. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Am I speaking to your mind? God wants to do a whole lot in your life. But he can't. 
He can't. Not that his hand is shortened. Not that he is no longer powerful. But anywhere God finds sin, he avoids. That is what Isaiah is telling us in that lesson. Can you take a bold step towards God? Towards God. That is what he is saying. Can you take a bold step out of sin and your sinful ways towards the finished work of Jesus Christ upon the cross of Calvary that is what the second lesson is telling us you that has been alienated from the, from the goodness and the greatness of God you that once live in darkness by reason of the shed blood of Jesus Christ has been given room and opportunity to enjoy and be a partaker with the saints in the light of God. To have abundant life. To have abundant life. Must we continue in sin? And say that grace should abound. So my submission on this is this. The same way Apostle Paul admonished the church at Corinth. I admonish you to continue in the faith that is grounded and settled in Christ Jesus. Be not moved away from the hope of the gospel of Jesus Christ. Anyhow, where the matter be today, if, if the, the matter self it bracket your destiny, it can't be like say nothing new that happen for your life again. Still hold on and hang on. There is light at the end of the tunnel. Let nothing drift you away from the presence of God. It may be tough, it may be rough. Stay put in Christ Jesus. In delay, the delay. Shubani did the omade, but it will surely come. Mazauka, am I telling them something? Jemo ba asorobi, am I telling them something? Jemo ba inson kokobi. Hold on to God. Your Lord, Omo. Oni di Jesus, Omo. Shagbegele. It may look tough. On my way to this place, I pass through rough roads. Yes, I pass through it. I pass through it. Several portals. But that wasn't my destination. It is just a passage. That situation in your life is just a passage. That is not where you are going. So don't hang there. Don't let it hold you down. Don't let, don't let it shank you. To, 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 to the other side where Christ is not you know the song 
Emi aduro ti Jesu ninu iriajo ayemi toro lo le sa mi toro le sa mi toro le sa mi toro lo le sa mi ke se bi ma se ye oni ise owo eniyan igede gba ere ni won le ti ko gboran o lo ju ko riran to wo tese aro ni o ti 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 ko fo un e yi ki so lorun e bi aduro ti jesu inu ile ajo aye mi to ro un o le ba ni to le ba ni to le ba ni so ro un o le ba ni I pray for you. Your leg will not miss. Amen. In the presence of God. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Let me go back to what I stopped. Because of those who started with us. This is the communique of the meeting. And I've said two or three out of it. That the communique God has sent to us after the meeting. The meeting of abundance. How you and I can connect to surplus. I told you number one is to seek the kingdom of God. So that other things can be handed to you. The second is to know the sound of the movement of God. For those who were here yesterday, I told you how God moved in my life. How he took a son away and replaced it with several ones. And took them from a low life to a greater life. And I also told you to yes, that yesterday again that have the gift and the spirit to discern. What you don't know, you can't have. What is you don't see in the spirit, you can't actualize in the physical. Joseph said, I had a dream. I saw stars. Eleven bowing to one. I saw sheets. I saw sheep. I want a uh, kini oka. Okay, bori uh -huh. ti oka. And eleven were bowing to one. Mokola one bori pale vuko. As he saw it, beauty ri. So it is. Ben no lo jeri. Eni robo re lo ju alato. Ondunu. Eni amoshe ni tori ebi. If you dream of wealth, that means you are a wealthy person as created by God. If you dream of marriage, that means marriage is for you. Which one be say I can't dream of marriage finish? They can't tell me say I belong to one water. Forget that thing. Who is interpreting such? As a man think in his heart. So is he. God brings to revelation. If you are pursued by ego in your dream, God is sending a message to you not to lose God. 
To step on the level of prayer. you can double cross you. You are an ego go be met. I just say ask. I can't wake from my dream. They come to me and say, Mark, Mark, go worship one ego go for my father's house. The person they seek. Am I speaking to someone? Even Pharaoh, that was not a believer, he came to revelation and he saw a dream of hunger in the land. Seven years of, of surplus and seven years of hunger. Thank God he got a good interpreter of dreams. As he dreamt it, so it is. He got us your face before here. Oh, do you call it Shall we live in hallelujah? Hallelujah. The spirit to discern. To know what is happening before it happens. You need it. To experience abundance. Number four. Believe the word of God. Am I saying something? The Bible says, as many as believe, it gave them power to become the children of God. There is power in belief. The power to become when you believe in the word of God, then the power to be that which you should be will come upon your life. It will not be difficult for you to ascend because power is available to you. It will not be difficult for you to assess to open doors. Am I speaking to someone here? Believe the word of God. Ah. Believe the word of God. It is not a story. It is not fable. It is not folklore. It is the mind of God. God. The manual that accompany creation. You need it to navigate this world. Without it, na bara bara chala chala rede rede. Like oni, it also no yi rede rede. You go the four, you go the wakastan, you go the four, you go the wakastan. Wa ma shubu, wa ma dide, wa ma lotweni. But if you have it. And you believe it, then you are good to go. Am I speaking to somebody? What Elijah told Ahab is the word of God. In that first king, 18 verse 1, the Lord, the Lord had told Ahab before, go and show yourself to King Ahab. I will send down rain. That is the word of God. So when he got to Ahab, what we refer to as prophecy is just a recap. Are you with me? And it's a compose like saying they prophesy. Waiting on yet, Tete. He can reach there, begin the form. Whether he form or he no form, 
Because God has said it. And he's using him as his mouthpiece. He has become, it has become the word of God. And the Bible said, Ahab believed. Ahab what is the word of God that you are yet to believe in your life? If you believe him, oh, if you will not believe God, for you to experience abundance will be difficult. There was a situation in the Bible where Peter and his crew they struggled all night to catch nothing. And Jesus appeared suddenly. And said, sink it into the deep. And Peter began rhetoric. Peter uh, is Awawi. Thank you. Sir. Yes, it's Awawi. Awawi. Yes. Uh, actually. Um, because of your word should I share something with you yes you are a product of the word of God let us make man look be a so, outside of the word of God, nothing. Constantly, consistently, and continuously, your life needs the word of God to keep alive. Number five, to retire. Number five. Number five. five. Value the messenger. Value the messenger. Are you here? Are you here? Are you here? That song sweet. It's sweet. Abby. Ijileishe. Lulu Waro. And one girlie. One wa jefun wa. One wa kesa wa agbabi. Confetti si le kongbo. Ekbele. Muki yin. Out of you and your elders, which amongst you have seen the angels talking to them? We just finished singing this hymn. Who amongst you can point that the angel delivered this word? I want to lead and sorrow. He's talking about his prophet. It is true, the prophets, that the angels speak to the church. To the angels of the church in Sadi. To the angels of the church at Ephesus. The angels will not manifest physically. If an angel should appear here right now, the altar will be empty. There will be commotion and confusion. Who can see the angel and identify this angel? angel? It is not the pictorial depiction that is the angel. Angel Look. Some angels are things of fear. But they use, they speak through the prophets, the mouth of the Now, if a prophet has been sent into your life, will speak to you the words of heaven. 
value the prophet. Value the man or the woman of God as God. If you value the word out of the mouth of the prophet, value him himself. Jehoshaphat is of Judah. Jehoshaphat told Judah. Only share share says you want to be successful. Only I bow Lord of God. Say believe in God. I was if he did him mule. And you shall be established. I bow only the God belu. Believed in his prophets also. I was if share it. And you shall succeed. Let me do that quick. Who wants to gather upon that? Jacob by any time. Let him believe he who has been sent. Jacob by in Russia alone. Let him believe in the messenger of God. I'm not saying there are no fake prophets. I'm not saying there is no but if somebody has been sent to you don't just take the word in levity are there people here a prophet brought you out and you want to step out you are supposed to take your wallet along because as soon as you're finished oh, you're you, you have to recognize and value the person no, so that has not been talked to you before. but I'm telling it to you today that which you are holding in your hand is what is called a fantasy it is not the word that has been delivered. It is not the word of God that is delivered. Go and do it. It is what has been given to the person. It is actually the gospel. The reward of a messenger. Only Am I speaking to someone? You know, team B1. Number five. I am number five. It out. So, six. number six. Promptly respond to prophetic action. Is somebody here? I'm a holy stupid. So no, I told you to take my SS. Can you not share my dear? Oh, stupid. What stupid is gone? So the stupidity one is she one now. Stupid. Can you not share one? So that's okay. Is she one stupid yo? Be only by so we share by. No, Gigi, to over five by yo. What is he telling me to do? This is not biblical. Look, the word of God says God used foolish things of the word uh, to confound yeah. the wise. Uh -huh. So sometimes prophecy could come out as being stupid and foolish. But the word of God standed firm in the word of his prophecy. Shemon Ben Kansoro. Shemon. Listen. Mama to be Jesus. The mother who gave birth to Jesus. Oh my, we will be stupid. She knew that prophets are stupid. Get let the wine turn as soon as the wine was finished. She won lo ba and they went to meet her. Mommy, o ti ti turn. Mommy, wine is finished. Ki le fe ki she si. What do you want me to do to you? She money where I sort in. Do I have a story? One one show what by in what you eh. They were not pointing before her. Epos tell your son. And the son responded. What is my business? With you, mother? Do yours apart. And suddenly, Mama is And his mother told them. Go and hold on to him. But listen to the warning. Whatever. Fallacy. Underline. Underscore whatever. Fallacy. Underscore whatever. Tobani keshe. That he asks you to do. Do them. Ni tori stupidity lo ma fi loyi. 
Because B, we a professor chemistry. And you are professors in chemistry and chemistry. Because I know he will ask you to go get wine. To turn into wine for you. And there is no chemical reaction. As we say, wine should come out of water. Show me what I your weight. Am I saying something to your mind? Basel. Am I saying something to your mind? Jemo Basel. Am I saying something to your mind? Jemo Basel. Shout a living hallelujah. Hallelujah. Shout a living hallelujah. Hallelujah. Shout a living hallelujah. Hallelujah. Rise on your feet. The day Gloria Sere. Because of time. Nitoria Siko. Are you on your feet already? Are you on your feet already? Let me break it into a revival session. While I do that, I want you to hear this from me. Are you here? When Elijah said he heard the sound of abundance of rain, many people will think the rain will just come. But the Bible says Elijah left the place and went to the top of Camel. This, this is prophetic action. Look, prophets or prophets are much more than what they are. There's a difference between the word of prophecy. There's a difference between the word of prophecy. Prophecy. Oh, the word of prophecy. Look, the word of prophecy you can be establishing in the gospel, but the actions of prophecy you have to. Pay Am I talking to somebody? Elijah Lasorio ke Kameli. Elijah proceeded to the mountain. Bibeli ni odoju bole. The Bible says he bowed down. Ori re wa la ni esere me change. His head was between his. Ni shaju i shaju. In every minute. On sofu amato tele. And he was telling the man. Oya lo wo ita wo. Go and look outside. Kilori. What did you see? Ni bato di ekeje. On the seventh time. Oni mori o kuru kuto shu saro. Since I saw cloud in heaven. Ejo mo bere. I beg you please. Kini Elijah bere don't she. What is or what was Elijah bind down doing? Oti sofu abu ojo maro. He already told Ahab that it's going to be to go home and to celebrate it. But Ahab do not know that there is only the understanding is only unto the prophet. Anybody for whomever would take vain of the prophet is taking vain his glory. Is taking vain his successes. Me, Nico, my show to I'm not saying you should not do what you like. But what I am telling you is when the prophet of God comes out he says this is what the God of God don't take it for vain. That which he himself is saying, he doesn't understand. He was only being pushed as he was being pushed. He is only saying it as the angels, the spirit of God is saying. That was a who a lady is a widow. She's a widow. Who is the husband? Is one of the elder prophets. It was a son after Elisha. But till she died, Elisha There was nothing Elisha could do to the world. I am a boss. I have servants under me. One of them now died. I could not do anything. Am I not to be put out? 
Has God called me? Abi pe mi o ti gori kodu. Is it that my call is down? Elijah shakpa soke. But Elijah rest is down. Oni ye ti kuno esi. Say go bury that one for now. Kilopagagan. What killed him actually? He shared the ocean. Poverty and penury. Kiwo li kiwo li ba ba wo liri. Kiwo li ba ba wo liri. That a prophet will not work with another prophet. Oh, a prophet working with a prophet. Oh, my holy, talk about now. Oh, nika yeda. That you know a sound prophet doesn't mean you're successful. Oh, nika holy, can la jashe o mi po ma shori re. That you have a prophet in a jashe does not mean you'll be successful. Oh, John Bonnie Oluwa we. A day is coming is what God has said. Holy, you cool. That the prophet died. Elisha uri nka kan she si. And Elisha couldn't do anything. Lord Jokan. And the day came. Lord Jokan. One day came. Omo biri ilo kolu Elisha. This woman went and confronted Elisha. Go ba wan kan she soro mi. If you will not do something to my master. Ma kute lo ko mi. I will die after my master. Ni tori a won ni kbe se o ko mi. Because there are debtors. There are debt owners. My first man is a debtor. Hello. Hello. Wo li je kbe se ku ni. The prophet was a debtor unto death. She mule bolle. Yes. She mwa agba kwe kwe uni soro. Mama soro jaduro. Eko ju sibi. Eko ju sibi. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. O jagbe se kunio. He was a debtor until death. Eko ju soro mi. Behold me. Talo sofu ekbe nashi olor o lekmo la sho. Oh my God. Talo sofu ekbe wo li o le wo akisa. Beke. Ki on she wo li ibi. Ki on she wo li di o sha. Wo li o lor wa la ye ni. Am I talking to somebody? Even though it was a prophet of God. Talo sofu ekbe i she o le mu wo li. Tabolu shwa aguta. Who says poverty cannot be old? Talo sofu ekbe ko le kbe kbe akbe ko ma toro. Who says a prophet cannot beg? She be one wasa hari yi if he won't she ye ye. Don't they come to your presence and make one crazy? She be one wasi shabu office abilere on ta wano. She be they will come visiting you or your pushing them. A jump on your lua we. The day is coming for God's sake. Party wa yek ba marina la hari. As we have come to the world to be, that's what we become. Elisha wu amo bire yi. And the lie. Elijah behold this woman and said, What should I do? Not all prophecies, the troubles in the world. What has not been revealed to a prophet in the world? If a woli should be shown off, and ask that who is consulting for, who is consulting for, where is your mother? Those that are writing messages, they will say it's not the truth. If he was a true prophet, oh, he's not supposed oh, to be asking. The Spirit of God is well, supposed to be asking. He won him on key. We are greeting you. You know all about prophets. You know all about prophets. But Elijah asked the question. What do you want me to do? Yeah, just as Jesus will ask. This woman would not answer. He answered, he asked the second one. What do you have at home? Is it that Elijah was stupid? Can he see the house? Can he see the pantry and the detector? His debtor, what can the detector have to do? Question, Lord, that you are asking another so question. But this woman answered. He says there is a jar at home. I want to send you a message. It, it is happening to me as if I should step down. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Are you listening to me? Are we in a revival? I want to step down. Now listen to what I want to say. And he told him. Go. 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 Kill on the color, Toro. Oh, the body wall. Oh, it will never draw be one of four containers. Moti Kuani was so moti bosses or G. We are in the body wall. Kill on the color, Toro. 
jars, containers. Listen. Listen. Dirty see me. Dirty see me. Look at me again. Wumi dara dara. If prayers have been said in the church, Oluwao, Lord, the spirit of death was removed from my life. Before you say Amen, first of all, know that if you will be successful by borrowing, the woman's of house killed by death, when the prophecy will come out, they ask him to go borrowing container. Go and borrow containers. Uncle, sir. Well, yeah, well, last week. Yes, sir. Glasses in it. He jab out it for. Motu a pada wa. Me it is sir. It is mo ya. Mo wa ne kento ya me glasses here ma ya me. Ah, difficult. Egg bag here ni ya me. Oh, ah, difficult. I want to ask you, Jenny Bessie. Those who was. I want to have a message in the court pada loba. Those are the people. Come at ba. Or come at toro lo wo wo. That you should borrow from them. Show ti wambi. Are you here? Show wambi. Are you here? Kino ni koma ashe. Kino ni koma ashe. Kino ni koma ashe. I wawa ni anti. She mo leri 1,000. Lo wawo yin beye. Wawo wak joke ji. Wawo wak pek pade lori oroe. Wawo fi e she ye ye. A wawo ni ishoro a ye deba o. Ki i she yi wawo. Am I speaking to somebody? Omo biri yi. O wa so e de kafu. Only to obat it by a jaw. To obat. Eh, she duro. Need to. To obat wale. To obat it wale. I wa ati omore. Only ti le kumora eh. So go in, lock your closet, yourself. She be abundance land so. And so ni pa e kurere. Only then so no abayo. And the prophet was talking about the yeah, world, about the abundance. And somebody is saying the holy or the prophet that we have you seen it in the Bible. And my God told hey, me that I will not bear. Hey, I will lend to nations. Oh, seek. Is it not God? Oh no, oh Lord, you got you. This is what I want you to take home. Now we pray. This is what I want you to take home. To enter into the premises and the principles of abundance. Use all these keys. If a prophet asks you to pick needle. Pick the needle first before you consult the Bible. If a prophet has not asked you to come worship lesser gods or idol, you may, he may not. Uh, you may not be deceiving you and you think he's deceiving you. The woman, because of shame, could not go. When they brought him, and she did what the Lord said, and oil was full, 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 Bring the further container. The boy responded, and oil was full, and oil was full,
Ogun te lo mi tori enji lago marun. To n wole lago mejila. Asotele ise woli kan le yanju eni seju kan. Sometimes the things you struggle unnecessary for, the direction of a prophecy can solve it for you in a minute. Are you listening? Now take out your envelope. See, I'm angry because of the word of the envelope. See, I'm angry because of the word of the envelope. Because when you are coming this morning, they really didn't tell you you're going to put something in the envelope. You only brought your offerings as usual. If it was me, this envelope, I'll put the money inside. What I really desire to put inside, and I will now write on it. I'll put my name and phone number. Even where I am right now, I'll put transfer to evangelist. Because if you give God little, you reward, you get reward of God. That you never saw sparingly, we reap sparingly. Let us not be deceived. Nobody can oh, so bad Whatever you oh, plant, you have asked. Look at me very I well. I am a farmer. I am a farmer. I farmer. I plant maize. I plant banana. I have coconut plantation. I have not got into my coconut plantation before that I get mangoes there. Because I planted coconut. Whatever you sow, shall you reap. Ashiri keje. Seven secrets is what is tied to this envelope. Everybody that wants to harvest and want a bountiful harvest, want a surplus harvest, must know how to give. Must know how to give. Our God Himself is a giver. Anything funny, anything riba. He is he who gives that he receives. Anything funny, anything riba. It is he who gives that receives. Anything fit a yo ta yo funny lo lo no fena. It is he who gives joyfully that God loves. Nitori na oya be be se yani si si. Now at this time, take a bold step. Nitori a sotel efe gori e koja. Because prophecy wants to come upon him. A sotel efe gori e koja. Prophecy wants to come upon it. A sotel efe gori e koja. Prophecy wants to come upon it. I want him undrode. We are waiting for you. When you are done, wave your envelope that you are ready. If you do not have envelope, get a piece of paper. No hand must be empty. No hand should be empty. Are you here? No envelope you see why you stretch for the envelope. Me, Nico, nah, okay. I don't say. So no, see what you stretch it out. No, see what you stretch it out. Oh, Lord, oh, Abraham, so I shiri come. Abraham spoke a mysterious word with Abraham. Oh, Lord, oh, God, so I shiri. God spoke with Abraham in mysterious. Only God, they see bang bang. He said, Come out to the world. Okay, now look. Show the Kaira. Can you count the only way you only see okay. you? And like only show the car, and you count them. only bear near one more. You say, So shall your shock be on war. I shall suck it. I raise a voice of authority. But when it don't know what away, Jade, everybody that is stretching for this, I be taught it. Tell you, the phone where she want or I send it through phone to that be talk. Cause he back when come by, you know, my fear or I said a vow of what he will send. Or in a lock for young true success and breakthrough. Only go back. That's your word. Eh? We will come to you in Jesus' name. From this day, the power to attract Agbara Latifamora, the immeasurable doings of God. I want until Lekin Katiko Sheka is share or war or law. Shall rest upon your life. Your from today, the 
Lord God of abundance shall be moved to do exceedingly more than you ask in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus from this day your storehouse shall be filled in overflowing measure from this day the almighty shall supply your destiny with the newness of life from this day a table of sumptuous meal shall be prepared before you your head will be filled with new oil. Amen. And your cup will overflow. Amen. From this day, the Lord will anoint your head in a manner that you will see everything you want over your enemies. From this day, your destiny will feed Amen. from the abundance of the presence of God. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. from this day, the river of the Lord's delight shall attend to your tests. Amen. In the name of Jesus. 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 In the name of Jesus. Amen. I am done. I am living. You see, I was done before I stepped down. As I am about living, there is a possibility that what you have brought forward that it may not call forth a harvest. It is not because you have not done what is right. But because it is a possibility. Anyone that will do that anyone that will stretch forth hand it is a must that he must receive I'm now standing in the midst right now on this mountain God is with us hey. It may be a male, it may be a female. Yeah. It may be a little one, it may be an elder. It may be a creature, it may be what we do not know. That will say this your outstretched hand will not yield. Amen. Such a thing, we will seek for it, we will no longer seek. Comparing the sacrifices to the horns of the altar. I say it the second time. And not saying you stretch for that. As a beggar. Or because the Look, the evangelism is not. It is because the way God has put in hand, that you shall also be a blessing. That a, an idol in your father's house, or a power in your mother's house. 
that says he just wants to show power. Or that he has been given your own testimony. That everything that must become of your life. He will stand and take it away from you. Both him and their trust. Amen. The Holy Spirit brings them down. Or is that Dagoni? The Dagon idol. The Luashi Godi. In, in the town of Ashtedon. Oh, yeah, Juni, what you are, Botieri. Oh, my God. On the presence of the Dagoni, we do not see him any longer. He broke down, broken neck, broken neck. I want to nick the devil, let the Dura. The owners could not carry him. I put it forward in decree. In the throne where it's not corrupted. In the throne where the secret cannot be revealed. All powers in your place of honor. That it will take all that belongs to you. Amen. Let them fall and rise no more. I have not come to Emmanuel Cathedral to come and pray or to come and look. I have not come to pray. I have come as a representative of all other kingdoms against your abundance. Amen. I say they will fall. My I am speaking of the covenant. In your father's house. In your father's house. That I said it will not be so. That you will you reap sparingly. That says you will lack. That I have wanted this man. Try. Whenever we shall see next, only your Tangali Gabre saw for me. Mobo won't come looking with me. Or a bitty does your neighbor talk, but I did not call it to die. Amen. Just so, oh, Luawa. Aha, Jesus. 